Good morning from Pigeon Forge in Tennessee. Starting off my birthday here at the Titanic Museum. Unfortunately, they do not allow you to film inside this place. But we're gonna start off here and then we're making our way to Gatlinburg where we're gonna be spending the day doing other fun things. Hi everybody and welcome to the world of Micah. It is my birthday today and I'm inviting you guys to tag along now. Let's take a closer look. You can see here the Titanic brushed that iceberg. Went into the Titanic experience. Didn't get the video, but took a few photos. They allowed you to take photos on the inside. It was a lot of fun. But now look at this traffic getting in to Gallenberg. Found a good spot to park. A little on the outside of the main strip. But this is where we're gonna be for the day. So let's do it. And I'll be honest with you, I'd like to see a bear on this trip. Haven't seen one yet. But I'm on the lookout. And traffic was so backed up, we just found a parking spot literally right outside of the strip. A dollar per hour, pay 10 bucks, not a bad deal. And there's my buddy zip lining yet again. All right, we're gonna buy a ticket and go to Anakista for the day. Gotta take the gondola and the chairlift up to the top of that, that mountain right there. Okay, we are on the, the chair heading up to Anakista. This is the, the lap bar here, and feet are dangling. And they have gondolas, but it was a long wait for the gondolas, plus I want to ride a gondola. And they also have a vehicle I think you can take to the top. So three different options. Either way, we're getting up there. You scared? <laughs> it's a, it, I, I was much braver when we were down on the floor, but it's a little scary up here. We used to ride the same thing to the top Woo! of Mount Gushmore. <laughs> yeah, but... At Disney, in bathing suits. It wasn't this tall, I don't think. Starting to slow down a little bit. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> this is going right over that house right there. That's kind of cool. I wonder if you can rent that or if people stay in that. You know, like, live in there for... What am I trying to say? Homeowners <laughs> or renters, not, you know, like a, a b and Airbnb. I think we're not even to the halfway part yet. We got to still go up a pretty steep incline. But this one's nicer than the other ones. The other ones around here go straight up, legit, just like straight up. But as you get closer, you'll get closer to the ground the way you're going up the side of the mountain. So it kind of takes away the, the height. But this is where we are now. Okay, I'd say we're about halfway there now. About to go over this road. Straight ahead. It goes down the side of this mountain that we're climbing and the weather is pretty nice today. Not a cloud in the sky. Wondering if we see any bears going up this. I've seen bears in the past hanging out on the side of the mountains like this. And look at that. There's a sign. No smoking, protect our forest. That's right. Here, bear. Where are you? There's like a checkpoint right up here, and then we're gonna go right up the side. Yeah, this is like the, the halfway checkpoint right here. Still looking for bears. This is what it looks like from behind. kind of crazy those hotels and cabins used to look way up there now we're about the same level and that's really cool oh here comes one of the the vehicles that'll drive you up to the top if you don't want to ride the the lift I'd rather do this. This is way more fun. And we are almost, almost there. Oh, they're going to take one more picture of us on the uh, the lift. That's right. I forget they do that here. But look at that view. All right, we made it to the very top. I know Abby is ready to 
to get off this thing. And we have made it to Anakista. This is pretty cool on top of the mountain here. Look at this. Look at this. And there's like a lookout tower up here. I think we're gonna do some of the ropes course and everything here. All right, going down to the bridge. Ooh. <laughs> this is great. Going across this bridge. Ooh, this one's whoa. <laughs> it goes like straight down. <laughs> That's crazy. And yes, they do bounce. That's pretty fun. I feel like Indiana Jones walking across this. Look at that drop. We're going all the way down. No running, but you can bounce. Because it bounces no matter what. This is great. This is so awesome. I love being in the mountains. Different trees here. White oak, chestnut oak, tulip, poplar, and hickory. All among us. Yeah, this makes Tom Sawyer's Island to like amateur hour. You don't get views like that. And the trees and the wind is amazing. But we're continuing down and then you go and it circles back up to where we first came in. Yeah, I'm waiting to see one of these. Look at that cute little face. Where are you, bear? Where are you? I want to find a bear. That is my goal today, to see a bear. Almost done with this. It sways to and fro. There's the space needle we were on. It looks tiny from up here. And the other strip downtown area of Gatlinburg. Making my way across the final bridge here. Got a new hat. Treated myself for my birthday. Hoping I can see Bigfoot too while I'm here in the Smokies. Climb to the very tip top of this 360 view here. See uh, what Gatlinburg looks like from that. All right, going up Ana Vista Tower is what it's called. And I made it. See, we were down there. They got a see through. And that's the main village. We first got up here, and there's the Space Needle right down there, and the rest of Gatlinburg, Tennessee. We are heading back down. Oh yeah, get some good views of Gatlinburg heading down. And it keeps us fun. Lots of places to eat and drink and walk around and just kind of hang out. 
by the way, with the admission, you can come and go all day. So you can go walk around the strip, go do something else in Gatlinburg, and then you can ride back up all day until 9 o'clock. Mm -hmm. So that's good to know. That was a lot of fun. I liked it. Some snow kids over here building a fort. Right now, I'm going to do the Moonshine mountain coaster right here off the main drag area of Gatlinburg. Wanted to do a, a mountain coaster. Filming this the safest way I can on the phone here. Here we go. I'm not gonna lie, I'm slightly terrified. I don't know what this is gonna be like. It's gonna be probably super fast, but I'm excited for this. Oh my gosh, it's going way, way up higher than I thought. Oh man. Yeah, this is gonna be awesome. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. That's what I'm doing for my birthday. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Oh man, this is getting some speed. Oh man. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, oh. oh my gosh, it's so fast. <laughs> oh. oh man, you can slow it down. Too, but no, oh, dude, we gotta get some speed. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> oh man! I think we're done. So it's like fifteen bucks to ride, eight dollars for a re-ride, and you can re-ride all day. Moonshine Mountain Coaster was awesome highly recommend we're gonna go grab some lunch and then hit up some more stuff on the strip so having a fun birthday so far new hat is bringing me some some fun luck i'm hoping i can see the lights tonight in their glory here on the main strip main drag we're gonna grab lunch here at no way jose's grab some some mexican food lunch was good we ate at a place called no way jose's pretty good food now we're gonna walk around the strip here next to the, the major creek. Oh, there's a cool duck. Right there, the only wildlife I've seen. I need to see a bear. Come on, bears. And step back into the mountain mall here. This place has not changed much since the 70s when it was built. And you gotta love the, the floor and the wooden ceilings. It's like stepping back in time in here. And this is what it looked like in 1912, according to the, the photograph here in the plaque. And then this is what it looked like in 1982. Wow. Not much has changed. There's an old school elevator system that'll take you up each individual floor or you can take the stairs. Also wanted to come say hello to Beauregard the Bear. Hey buddy, Taffy Alert. Look at this. This is being stretched out. Isn't that crazy? It's mixing it all together. Look at that. All right, crossing the street. Stopped off here yesterday, but it was raining pretty, pretty good.
holidays and Christmas attire here at the Old Smoky Moonshine. And I didn't get to show a lot of this yesterday because of the rain. This is the Ripley's Moving Theater 5D. And this dinosaur always reminds me of the Back to the Future dinosaur. You know, when the DeLorean gets like right up there on that thing. And I noticed here at the Ripley's Haunted Adventure, there's a character hanging out right here at the front. He's wanting me to come in. I know this guy. Oh, he knows me. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, man. Am I staying around or am I going? I think I'm going to go. It's good to see you. I get a box just your size. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> of course, a character in Gallenberg, Tennessee knows who I am. I was hoping I would meet some more locals while I was here. Never got to see a bear today, but the, bay, the day's not over. I could see a bear. Ran into this guy, though. There's some bears here. Look at this. Not the bears I was looking for, though. And here comes one of the trolleys. We'll take you all around town. Found the Headless Horseman. Look at that. Not gonna lie, it's a little scary over here by myself. Oh, he's pointing at me now. He's pointing at me. Ah! <laughs> Quite possibly the smallest Shonies I've ever seen that's still open. Not a lot of Shonies left still open. And there's Flapjacks, the Pancake Cabin. I'm hoping these lights here on the strip, the main drag here, cut on very soon. Sun's going down, so I'm going to go down here to Ober and see what's going on on this side of, of Gatlinburg. And this is Howard's restaurant. It's been here since 1946. It says old log cabin style. And this is Ober Gatlinburg area here. And inside, it's like an old, another old school mall here. Look at this old school seating. Lots of stores, two stories. Let's see if we can get a view of Ober, Gatlinburg. Yeah, this is where the, the gondolas take off. And they go right up the side of that mountain there. I haven't been back here since I was a kid. I remember walking up here and looking at this old gondola that just sits out here. They have it out here for you to take photos. Wow, isn't that rad? Old school, man. It's been out here for a long time. And then this is the, the main area where they come in. Looks like something you would see at the Contemporary or Epcot or something. There's some old school architecture here that's pretty awesome like this. Definitely looks like something from the 80s and 70s. I love it. I was hoping this gondola would take off, but it's not going to. This is Sugarland Chapel, it says. Old school church. You don't see them like this anymore. The stained glass, really pretty. Yeah, see, this is what I like, is the old log cabin style places. This is Cumberland Jack's restaurant here. And then across the street is Crockett's Breakfast Camp. Oh man, that's rad. I mean, look at this. Of course, I'm gonna go check this out. Oh man, of course, when I stepped over here, the gondola took off in the distance. There it goes. <laughs> that's all right, but check this out. Crockett's Breakfast, Tennessee Saw Company. 1875 only open from 7 to 1 omelets cat head stacker hen fruit 
Maple features waffles, scramblers, griddle cakes, giant cinnamon rolls. All right, yeah. And then Davy Maples Sr. gave him the nickname Crockett. So it's not the Davy Crockett we know. This is no Fess Parker, but this gentleman was born in 1840 and died in 1928. And this is the restaurant named after him. And right there is the very end of the strip. And I'm gonna head back down. It's killing time, hoping these lights will kick on anytime now. All right, heading back. Well, you can see the lights are turned on the bridge up there. And the ski lift going up. But unfortunately, the lights are not on down here on the strip. Kind of disappointed. Well, I might not be able to see some lights here in Gatlinburg, but tomorrow we'll definitely be able to see some lights. Looking forward to my trip tomorrow. You guys will have to wait and see what we do. But today was super fun. I hope you guys had a lot of fun watching. Tomorrow is going to be another fun day here in Gatlinburg Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. But I think it's time to say goodbye. Thanks for hanging out with me on my birthday. This was a lot of fun today, and I will see you guys tomorrow on another fun-filled episode. Thanks for reaching out on social media today. A lot of people sent me messages on Instagram. Thank you guys, it means a lot. And for those of you who commented on my video, happy birthday, thank you. That also means a lot, but I'm out of here. See you guys on the next episode. Until then, stay weird, goodbye.